Good morning, everyone. I'm Riley King, and welcome to my morning news report right here on the Riley King Network, and Merry Christmas Eve, everyone. Let's begin. Recycle Percussion buys toys for thousands of children for Christmas. For five years, Recycle Percussion has made it their mission to bring Christmas to kids who may not have toys under the tree otherwise. The New Hampshire-based group bought thousands of dollars of toys at Walmart Saturday using money they raised on their 50 and 12 mission across the country. This year, the toys won't be given out on Christmas as New Hampshire is expecting inches of snow. Instead, the drive will now be held on Christmas Eve. All those toys were brought to the Manchester Fire Department where they were sorted and organized. It took Lieutenant Patrick left over of Burlington Fire Department and his son Dalton almost four hours to get to Manchester in the bad weather to come pick up toys to bring back to their donation site. But they said it's all worth it. People wishing to receive Toys must fill out the form on Recycle Percussion's Facebook page. There will find location and times for pickup on Christmas Eve. And now let's take a listen to this video from WMR News 9, Cherise LeClaire. Watch out, SBK fans! The most loved and popular toy is on a big adventure, touring live and coming to your city. Shop It's Live, Shop It Up is here! Coming to the Hanover Theatre for the Performing Arts, March 2nd. Tickets at ShopKidsLive.com. <laughs> Thousands of dollars to spend inside Manchester Walmart. All of these toys will be handed out to children in need on Christmas Eve. We play the show in 50 states in 12 days, and we're able to raise almost $70,000 that we're going to give out to not just kids on Christmas Day, but also families that are in need. So a lot of us will go tell families that are struggling this time of year. And this year, the toys won't be given out on Christmas Day. The weather is pushing the drive to Christmas Eve, so those hoping to donate or receive toys won't have to drive in the Christmas snow. But Justin Spencer says he wanted the kids to have the opportunity to play with their toys on Christmas Day. I guess super stoked. You know, to see kids to come in and get to pick their, you know, these kids have to come and pick whatever gift they want. All of those toys were brought to Manchester Fire Department, where they're sorted and organized. It took Lieutenant Patrick LaFive and his son Dalton of Berlin Fire Department almost four hours to get here in the bad weather to come pick up toys to bring back to their donation site. But they say it's all worth it. It's amazing. I mean, you can see the full bay of toys. I mean, it's never ending. The kids are going to love it. Our goal is to help, uh, you know, almost 4,000 kids on Christmas Day, uh, have a really special Christmas, and that's what we're going for, and that's what we're that's what we're doing here today. Now, for people wanting to receive toys, you must first fill out the form on Recycled Percussion's Facebook page. You can check out their Facebook page for locations and times for pickup tomorrow as well. And for more information, log on to our website, WMUR.com. Okay, and there you go on that video and that report from WMUR News 9, Cherise LeClaire. And that is for my news report right here on the Riley King Network. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day. I will be off air tonight and tomorrow and on Tuesday. I'll be back on air on Wednesday. Have a wonderful Christmas, everyone. Goodbye.